afternoon, everyone. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com, and welcome. Welcome to KL. This is one of the StockSwish shows plays of the day. There's actually two plays of the day today. Really just nailed two things right out of the gate today. Huge morning and so happy and just great way to start the week, especially if it's a short week. And it was a short week today, and, and it was hard to read the market. I read the market well, got my shorts. Market was long. Shorts came in, had two quick plays. My day was done. Look at split. And this was the one. So this came in late as far as the gap, but you always have that on a Monday, which is basically today because it's Tuesday because the market was closed yesterday. And I felt like if this broke a certain level, it was just going to go. And possibly could keep going all day. Really, the target's 37 on this and lower. I mean, I'm out. I think it would still be in this. It's actually setting up again. It's already triggered. But the first trigger back in the 5 was here. Second trigger never set up in here. You had to wait, wait, wait. Here it did in here. Now you've got the confirmation this bar here. You could still be in this. Trigger it in the 15 minute and you could put the stop tight here or you could put it over here. You got to stay with this though. You got to stay with this though. And the only way you do that is if you really have the conviction it's lower. This is lower though today. It looks good. You, you, this is an all day play now though if you're short this. So it's, you can't expect uh, clickies in the afternoon. And with the market rallying to try to make new highs, I, I just don't think it's the best idea to be in afternoon shorts. But this does still have target in it. Still has potential. Still is good to risk, risk to reward in the setup. So let's look at the trade. Really, really, really was aggressive on this uh, initially. And came on down. Came on down hard. Rallied back up. Called a second trade in this. Called a third trade in this. There was lots of trades in this today, actually, and you could have done multiple ads, and it had a beautiful move all the way down here from 37.88 all the way down very quickly to 37.31. Nice, solid move in that. Uh, really, really had the conviction that if it held right away, it was going to work. Wanted to do it aggressively. Did. Which is in a way again. Yep, it's going to go to 37 today. So this is KO. This is the stocks will show one of the plays of the day. It set up right away, was in it, and out for a quick play, which is what I like to do. And this did do what it was supposed to do. There's follow through on this lower. This is will continue. I don't know if this breaks down here today all the way down to this area under the 37 number. It's possible it could. I did say today if this broke early that it was there was no holding this back no matter what the market did, which is playing out that way, and that it had a bigger target in sight. I do think you have to be realistic, though, about anything that breaks 37 around this number here. But honestly, if it breaks 37 early, it's still early for this to get down if it breaks a new low into lunch. This could drop off and fall off and drift off all day. This, this, this is a good follow through, actually, for an overnight short. I don't know where this is going to close today, but depending on that, here, it's, this is setting up again right in here. Just backed up in here, tried to get over 50, couldn't do it. And this is already underway again. Really nice trade. This is going to get to 37. So under the low, it's 37.26. Then it gets down to 37. And the next number is 37.75 uh, ish. And then it's anybody's guess where it wants to go. Depends how big of a bar this closes today, where it actually ends up tomorrow morning. But this could certainly fall through tomorrow if it doesn't have a crazy red bar today. We'll have to see. Beautiful weakness here in this KO. Came out late in the morning, still was able to get it. Here, here this goes. This is this is that was it. This is gonna break down here over the lunch. You gotta be in it already though. Beautiful, beautiful play of the day here in the KO. So this is the Stock Swish Show live trading room. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. KO was a quick play today. Loved it, liked it, out quickly, and again had a big drop down, and you could have reshorted it. So you can take this trades, chunk it out, get out. Take it again, get out. You can do that if you want. You can do that if you want. Sometimes you have to wait, though, when you take a late play. And I'm very impatient. I don't like to wait too long. So that's why I love the morning. And this this uh, had the nice, aggressive move immediately. Confirmed the weakness in the chart. Uh, beautiful setup in the KO. And and have all the numbers, actually, which was really beautiful, too. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. If you'd like more information how to find gaps like KO and short them and play them on the day, and rate the gaps and know that this was going to work, email me at melissa at the stockswish.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a fantastic day.